I've covered in the past why you gain weight from creatine supplementation, and yet there are a significant number of people that don't gain weight from creatine supplementation. So, well, what gives? Is this a good sign? What does it mean? Well, let's get into it. Learn your body, a science-based education. Normally, people ingest creatine and their body absorbs it to fill the cells of the body. The effectiveness of that supplementation is evidenced by a sudden sharp weight gain. Like I said, that's discussed in other content, but a large minority of people experience no weight gain when they supplement with the molecule. So what does that mean for you? It means either something really great or it means the exact opposite. Uh, in one situation, your body cells produce and take up enough creatine without supplementation to saturate their maximal amount. That'd be great because it would imply that you can stop supplementing. It's wasted money since your body will simply dump it by excreting it. However, the alternative scenario is that for some reason, your cells are not taking it up. This could be for, well, all kinds of reasons. Maybe you're born with no creatine transporters. That's the protein that allows creatine into the cells on your muscle cells, or you don't have any creatine transporters in your intestinal tract. So it never even gets into your bloodstream to reach the rest of your body's cells. It's also possible that it's liberally excreted once it enters the bloodstream. The point is, for some reason or another, creatine doesn't enter the cells, so supplementing with it will do nothing for you. You're considered a non-responder. So which is it? Is it the good thing or is it the bad? Well, there are tests that you can perform, but they tend to be detailed and take some serious commitment as well as laboratory access. However, unfortunately, it's more likely the latter scenario, that your cells simply aren't able to access the creatine for some reason. Either way, save yourself the money. Stop supplementing. Although somewhat discouraging, I hope this proved informative and helpful, and I'll hope to speak with you in the next one. Cheers.